It's early. The sun hasn't come up. My voice has still got the frog in it. But I wanted to take a couple of minutes and share with the family that fact that my back has miraculously improved in the last weeks. Truth be told, I'm a little hesitant because worried about what happens if this is just temporary. But regardless, I need to give praise to the Lord, thank those that came over and prayed for me, encourage those that think a little bit at a time doesn't make much of a difference, period. As I probably mentioned to most of you during a couple of week period, three individuals came over impressed to talk to me about the fact that they were impressed by the Lord to come and pray for me, and they did. I also must add that the physical therapy that I have been working on, I have been consistent in. It's seemingly meaningless as you just do little bits and pieces of exercise for the knees and for the core. None seem to have any great impact, but the fact that they're done each day, even for short periods of time, over time, makes such a big difference, period. Between that and the prayer, I have been in the woods for five different days now, for from noon till dark, carrying chainsaw, running brush cutter, climbing and moving big deer stands, and coming home at night very tired, but the back the next morning is painless, period. I sat in church on Sunday for the first time in maybe years and didn't have any pain, period. So grateful, and I wanted to share that with you. And those that have been praying for my back, thank you, because the prayers that are sent to our Abba Father in heaven do have an impact in a meeting. I will finish with simply saying, I want you to know that I pray for you at 1218 each day, period. Also, most mornings as I get up and sit looking at the lake if the sun is up or this morning at the fireplace as it is going. And you are the first on my prayer list. The 15 of you that have either come into our life by birth or by being chosen by our children are so special. The greatest gifts that we have been given and uh, we are grateful for you. I thank you for listening or watching the fire flicker and do want you to know that we do love you and can't tell you that enough. So looking forward to the minutes and hours we get to spend with you this weekend. May it be a special time where we share with each other the things that are on our heart, the blessings that we have had, the, the good and the bad, the things that make us cry and the things that make us laugh. That's what family is all about. And that's what deer hunting opener tends to be, where one of the few times during the year we all gather. Love you guys much and see you soon.